find your friends, find those people online or in the real world who make you feel better about yourself. Get yourself with a peer group of people who respect you, who love you, appreciate you, who you appreciate and love, and spend more of your time there. And really search for true friends. If you just have one person by you who loves you, then that's all you need. Positive relationships and meaningful relationships and peer relationships that can be really like productive and make you feel better about yourself. The people that are closest to you, your, your real friends, which a real friend would never make fun of you. He, you know, invited me places, things like that. If people, you know, made fun of me for speaking funny or having long hair, he told people don't do that. He told people that that's not cool and that making fun of people is just not a good thing. I had a couple friends. We were all a bunch of nerds. And I wasn't bullied by other kids around the school, but inside this group, I was just constantly harassed. And I finally saw it how it is. Like, I really don't need them. If that kind of drama is going on, I, I don't need to be in it. Once I was out of it and I saw it from a different perspective, I realized that it was just a miserable group of girls. And so then I just, you know, learned from that experience. And now I know how to choose friends. The way that I coped with it was by making another group of friends outside that group of people who were mean to me so that I had some sort of support system. When you go to somebody and you really feel like you can just vent and you can just get everything out and they're there to listen, they're there to give you a hug, they're there to help you even if there's no advice given, they're just there. Um, I feel like that's, that's a way that you can really know that they're the people who you can count on.